video number two for you guys. Uh, this segment is for all those parents out there who have trouble getting workouts in and want to do some runs and stuff like that. So we're at the track today. We're going to do three by 300 meter sprints. Uh, as you see, I have Maverick with me. He is asleep, but that doesn't matter. So what we're going to do is we're going to pop him out of there. We're going to put him in the jogger stroller. And, uh, you know, as you start running anyway with a with an infant, they will tend to fall asleep during some part of the run. So it's good for them to get a good nap while you, uh, while you run. So this is for all those parents out there. If you do not have a jogger stroller, I recommend you get one, please. It is the best investment uh, that we have. Uh, so that way I can get my sprints in and still enjoy going to some track meets without suffering my training. All right, I hope you guys enjoy. All right, y'all, see, we're at the track. And uh, right now, we're just gonna get our warm up in.
All right, y'all, two down, one left. Let's get it done. All right, y'all, just finished the last one. I will tell you, pushing this jogger stroller, doing sprints is no joke. But you know what? Got to get it in, got to get it done. For all you average people out there, just get off the couch. You can do it. Get on the track, get in the gym. Future upcoming, I'm gonna be doing home workouts to show you how it's done. And also, shout out to Suk and Shaw. I'm gonna be doing, excuse me, I'm gonna be doing a hotel workout. And all you gotta do is buy a band. All right, let's get it done. Let's do some starts, some abs, some hamstrings, rock out of here. Cause homies gotta eat. See you later. What's up my fat friends? Alright, we just got done that track workout. Did a quarter mile warm up. We did dynamic warm up, dynamic stretching. We did uh, sprint drills. We also got some core work done. We did some hamstring uh, with the band. Uh, more like a Romanian deadlift with the band. So it was, it was a good workout. It, it took about maybe a little over an hour. Uh, got the little man home. We're chilling here, right buddy? He's walking around in his walker. We're doing good. So, future events to come. We're gonna do a hotel workout. We got um, how to build a booty coming up. I'm gonna show you guys how uh, I wake up in the morning with a small amount of time to get some nutrition in, get your first meal in, and get a meal in that will digest quickly so that way when you go and do your training or you go into the gym, um, that you're well uh, lubed up and ready to go. You got nutrition, you got energy, and you, and you got fuel for the fire to burn. So I'm going to show you guys all how to do that. It's going to, like I said, these videos are out here for the average person who has trouble um, getting workouts in, especially when you have a child or you have children, multiple children, and you just can't fit it in. Well, 
I have one saying, if you got time to watch TV, you got time to work out. Um, also, uh, there's going to be some information coming up. Uh, I get questions all the time as, uh, hey Matt, how can I lose my belly? Can I do sit-ups? No. Number one, sit-ups will not make you lose your belly fat. What makes you lose your belly fat is depleting your calories of what you can expend during the day. So if you come out under the calories which you're expending the calories that you do in a day, that will shrink you down and then you will start to see your muscles. What's covering your muscles is fat. And the reason why you have fat there is because of what you ate. It's not what you did. Okay, it's not the exercise that you didn't do. It's what you ate to get there. So you have to eat clean and lean to get rid of that fat so that way you can see your muscles. So, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get some calorie intake in, how to measure your stuff, how to do it efficiently, uh, how to meal prep, uh, so that way you can have your nutrition with you whenever you need to eat. And when you're working out, this is a lifestyle, this isn't a fad, this isn't something you do for a little while and then just go back to your regular habits. So as, as you watch more videos coming through, you're going to learn how to wake up at a certain time, go to bed at a certain time, eat the right way, you're going to eat every two to three hours. Um, I am not a registered dietitian, but these are just things that I do that maybe you can follow through and mimic what I do uh, or uh, give you ideas on how to get healthier and fit. Um, also we're going to be doing hotel workouts, in-home workouts, outside workouts, and we'll also be doing in the gym workouts. So I hope you guys enjoy what you like seeing so far. And if you do, shoot me up, subscribe down below, get on my page, get on my channel, hit me up, uh, give me some comments, uh, you know, anything you'd like to see, anything you'd like to know. All right? Hope you guys have a fantastic day. Be kind to others, love one another, and be great. Have a good one. Peace out.